Meanwhile, Imran Khan continues to be at the center of Pakistan's political drama. The Pakistan Tehreek-e Insaf chairman has now accused the coalition government of hatching a conspiracy against his party. He said that the government has prepared a plan to crush the PTI. While addressing his supporters via a video link from Islamabad, Imran Khan said that a frightening conspiracy had been devised to pit the Pakistan's biggest political party and the army as opponents. They are trying to crush us by showing muscle power. They are damaging the country. We are observing TTP's activities in Khyber Pakhtunkhwa. I have been told that they are targeting PTI leaders. I am appalled by it. Imran Khan has further slammed the coalition leaders, saying that they went to international platforms to oppose the army, and yet they were being labelled as, and yet they were labelling the PTI as a traitor. He said that the government was using different tactics to break the party, as it had the largest vote bank. Now, Imran's statements have come after the government alleged that the former prime minister and other PTI leaders were spreading hate against the country's institutions. The coalition government has accused the PTI chief and also his wife Bushra Bibi of tasking the party's social media teams to target the army and the army's top brass and also the martyrs of Pakistan. ARY channel ne tamam sahafti takazon ko ki dhajiyan urate hue Imran Khan's chief of staff and his representative Shabazz Gil read the script given by him and that interview was televised by the RA news channel for 15 minutes without any interruption. He asked his social media team to run a campaign against Arami. Those people were caught and they accepted that they were following the party's orders. On Tuesday, the PTR leader and also Imran Khan's chief of staff, Shahbaz Gill, were arrested on charges of sedition and inciting the public against state institutions for his statement against the Pakistani forces. The authorities accused him of calling for rebellion within the forces. The Gill's two-day physical demand with the police ends tomorrow. And amid the political rumbles and the speculations of Imran Khan facing possible arrest, Punjab province's chief minister, Parvez Ilahi, has advised the PTR leadership to dissociate itself from Gill's anti-army statement, Ilahi has asserted that Gill's statement had done more damage than good. He further claimed that there was no step forward for Imran Khan without Pakistan's army's support. Vyond is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.